Now to developing news surrounding a plane crash that killed three people in the Hamptons, including a man from Connecticut. This morning, federal authorities are trying to determine what caused that plane to go down. Officials say the victim from Connecticut was 41 years old. They also say he ran a flight school. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter David McKay joins us live this morning at Waterbury Oxford Airport, where that man frequently flew from. Right, David? Raj Persad's body was recovered along with two others off the coast of New York. Authorities say the twin-engine Piper PA-34 took off from Danbury Airport, then crashed into the Atlantic Ocean just south of the village of Quag. Prasad's family told Eyewitness News that he frequently flew from Danbury and Waterbury Oxford Airport, where we are this morning. He lived in Waterbury and leaves behind two daughters. He loved education. He believed that girls should be able to read and write and be strong leaders. He was very adamant about our education. And I think that's what really inspired him to become an instructor because he loved teaching people. It was a surfer who told police he saw the plane go down. Several pieces of the plane were found, but the fuselage is still missing. The National Transportation Safety Board is still looking the, the rest of it, and actually the exact cause of this crash. We'll have more about Prasad's family, their reaction to this crash, and more about the investigation in the next half hour. Live in Oxford, David McKay, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.